Yo, man, what's going on? Welcome, welcome back. We are going to be continuing Young Justice today. This is episode 7, Depths. Artemis is going to be returning. And it said, will this first mission back be her last? Probably not. Um, but you know, they gotta say something ominous <laughs> in the description to try and catch y'all. But I was gonna watch it anyway, so I don't need no hook. So we gonna see what they talking about in this episode, man. Let's watch. You're freaking out over nothing. What could go wrong? Twenty-eight. Twenty-nine. <laughs> Are y'all serious? <laughs> okay, obviously she's not dead, but like, damn, how you gonna start the episode off like that? She's dead. Okay, she did die. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, y'all are so stupid. Flatlined, but they gonna end up bringing her back somehow. <laughs> what could go wrong? Yo, y'all are funny, bro. Oh my god, don't eat so fast. I can't help it, angelfish. Bro, Superboy's face just explains how everybody's feeling. Like, get out of here, bro. If I had to take a guess, sooner or later, there's gonna be a time where Lagoon, Lagon, whatever the hell fish man's name is he's gonna have to do us a, a duo mission with superboy and it's just gonna be them two it would genuinely surprise me if they didn't do that let's just say that after running this team for a year i'm peckish for a little action about time i know he was doing some stuff in that in that other episode where aqualad was revealed to be black mana but nightwing is one of the main reasons i started watching the show <laughs> You better get your ass back in the game. Start doing, getting more screen time. Meanwhile, she flies the friendly skies alone with Super X boyfriend, Neptune's beard. Boy, I understand Aqualad's on the opposing side, but man, if you come back, if you decide to come back, do a one on one with Legolas, Legoon, nigga, <laughs> whatever his name is, I already know Aqualad is finna whoop his ass. Of how I use my psychic powers. You mean how you abuse them? Yeah. I knew it. I knew it. If you feel that strongly, why not tell Nightwing? I was hoping I mattered enough to you to make you stop. I didn't think you'd try to tamper with my mind. Try to make me forget I was upset with you. Sorry you did it. What? Or sorry you got caught. Oh my gosh, that nigga's cooking the fuck out of her. How could you think I wouldn't recognize your touch inside my mind? Oh my gosh, that nigga's cooking the fuck out of her. Oh my gosh. Yo, nah, she's actually tripping. Two minutes after I ended, you're dating the rebound guy from the Black Lagoon. Lagoon is not my rebound guy. He quite literally is. He quite literally is the rebound. Like, what are you talking about? Second he broke up, <laughs> you rebounded. That's that's what that means, bitch. The fuck? Nah, that is devious work, bro. She tried to manipulate his mind, make him forget that that happened. Look at me. Stand down. Sorry, you're with this up. arrogant ass so nigga. <laughs> nah, bro, that made it even deeper, bro. I can't even lie. That that nigga's words was cutting her deep. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about, oh, if it's so bad, why don't you tell the rest of the league, nigga? Huh? <laughs> he was hoping he wouldn't have to. You goofy bitch. <laughs> you should know better. Oh my God, I'm on my way. I can't even lie, bro. I can't even get over that. <laughs> and she didn't even do that shit to be like, bro, you went into that nigga's head and tried to make him forget that you do. You're like, yo, nah, that's crazy. That is beyond wild. <laughs> You're actually weak as fuck, nigga. <laughs> Didn't even have to get like a setup 1v1. Bro is treating him like quite literally like what he is, a side character. So the rest of the league still doesn't even know of how McGann is abusing her powers. Solar Flare! I'll take charge of the ground assault, personally. Oh, yeah. See, like, bro, the, the voice actor mixed with this nigga being on BT, like, you, you can't even lie. He's cool as fuck. <laughs> nigga, Aqualad. Aqualad is badass right now. I wonder if it's gonna be Aqualad that ends up accidentally killing Artemis. Oh my- Oh my- Oh my gosh. Bro, he emerged like a fucking final boss. Are you serious right now? Okay, she alted. She is indeed serious. Wait, whoa. 
Oh. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> That was fire. Finally, using your powers how we would expect them to use them. This is such an uneven matchup, too. What the hell? <laughs> of course, the second somebody turns to the opposing side, they start unlocking new abilities that they, they ain't never used. When <laughs> I feel like he did use something like that before in the last season, but it just wasn't as strong. Blood has been in the lab. You better snipe it, bitch. You better snipe it. Yeah. Finally hitting your shots. Aww. Yeah, I. Oh my. Welcome back. That nigga's a demon. <laughs> what? Move out. The mission is a failure. He doesn't even care. Whoa, what happened? No, this nigga Aqualad's actually a demon. No, he's actually not like be yo, be so dead ass right now, man. He looked her dead in her eyes and said, Welcome back. That is the most diabolical shit I have seen all day. You can't even come back from that. He literally he walked away thinking that he just killed her. Had zero remorse. Even if he were to turn heel. Like, you gonna forgive somebody that <laughs> fucking killed you? What the hell? Because I'm banking on that she's gonna be brought back. Rocket must have malfunctioned. Our victory was mere luck. I arranged to have a bomb with an altitude sensor smuggled onto the ComSat rocket days ago. This was your final test. Wow. That was actually a fire test. <laughs> to see if you would take credit for something that you didn't do. Yep, I'm testing this character. You still a bitch, though. <laughs> Not gonna lie, Aqualad. You on some ho shit right now. He is on the most demonic timing <laughs> I have seen in a minute. I haven't seen anyone turn heel like him and, like, have zero remorse, zero doubt that he's right in a long ass time everybody else usually still like questions themselves a little bit he has complete resolve in what he is doing no what the welcome back they may never forgive us and still only we four know the secret Nigga, that wasn't even a good plot twist. Fuck y'all niggas, bro. <laughs> what could go wrong? <laughs> Don't say that. Nigga, what? That plot twist is honestly disgusting. I'm not gonna lie. That was just nasty as fuck. Mad grimy. I feel betrayed. That was so ugly. I think, um... I think I gotta sit on that one for a little bit. I gotta, I gotta let that episode marinate. <laughs> what the hell was that? <laughs> like, honestly, genuinely, genuine, uh, uh, bro, truly, truly, what was that? What is that? What is this? What is going on? Only the four of them know. Everybody else is in the dark. I'm pretty sure in that scene, she had blood on her chest before that nigga even crushed whatever he crushed the damn die or whatever, but like, and I saw she bit something, that thing that makes it, uh, makes your heart stop temporarily. Something like that. This nigga, Calder, is a, a, a an Oscar award winning level actor, basically, is what you're telling me. Because <laughs> when Aquaman stole off on his bitch ass, and he, him and Nightwing were going back and forth explaining why he turned to the other side. But he was acting. And he really did choke slam the hell out of Superboy. That ain't, uh, that wasn't part of the script. <laughs> he wasn't supposed to be down there. <laughs> they just said he genuinely had to make a choice there. A hard choice on whether or not he wanted to save everybody or completely nuke that island. And he chose to nuke that island, which killed some of the cro cro latex and cloak whatever the hell they're called crolatanians Ugh, bro Ugh, that that i don't like that brother i don't like how that made me feel that plot twist was genuinely grimy like it's not even it's not even like <laughs> how do i explain this shit the setup of it is just them 
blatantly lying to our faces <laughs> like dead ass these niggas are just straight up lying to everybody it's not even like a oh you could have seen this coming there was some foreshadowing here like no you niggas are just straight up lying right now not dropping no hints or subtle clues that hey he might uh not like the only thing that was obvious was artemis clearly not being dead because they haven't really had anybody die on screen that like vividly i guess you could say because the nigga literally just stabbed her <laughs> and left her on the ground but because she didn't really die they let it slide what is the point bro genuinely at the start of the season they start off with everybody uh, everybody having secrets and keeping secrets from each other and then by the end of the season you know they start telling each other the truth and confessing letting all the skeletons out of the closet just for the next season to start and them to be lying to each other all over again like really all of you are terrible <laughs> y'all are all terrible people man so what like it whenever aqualad does reveal that he wasn't he didn't actually betray them w w what's gonna happen is there gonna be a punishment for this i don't know i guess we'll find out what happened to me how can there be another Roy Harper? And what happened to my arm? <laughs> Crashing out. I guess the moment's here. Moment's passed. Get to it. Damn, that nigga on timing. No idea Luther had stored you on ice all this time. You gave up on me. Seems to me the clone didn't do anything wrong. I can't blame him for this. But I can totally blame you! Okay, <laughs> it's a... Holy! How did I not see how useless you are? Damn! Get out! Holy shit! Yo, these niggas is all crashing out on each other. This is a season of um, straight <laughs> emotion, bro. Everybody. Everybody is in they acting bag right now. I've never even heard this voice actor get that loud before. <laughs> on all the roles that I've heard him play, he's usually like really calm and mellow, like nonchalant. I've never even heard him turn up like this. That is how useless you are. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Roy, listen, I... That boy gone, man. That boy is gone. I can't even... Like, yeah, I understand exactly why that nigga mad. <laughs> it, it is justified anger, but I feel as if that is misplaced. Misplaced blame. Saying Green Arrow, Green Arrow just should have known better after finding the clone, even though he's a direct clone, all the memories, nothing wrong with him, nothing, no tell. Like, I guess you could be like in a universe like this. He should have suspected or like tried to make sure, but like, that's just, that's just unrealistic, bro. Who would that? Wait, who's that other Robin? That nigga look clean. Robin is Batman, Nightwing, and Batgirl. That nigga look clean, bro. <laughs> that Jason Todd looks clean. Or that Robin. I don't know if it's Jason Todd. I'm just assuming. This has been the hardest two days of my life. Harder than prison. Losing the use of my legs. Damn, bro. Y'all didn't even tell her mom. That's kind of messed up, bro. That's not even kind of. That's super messed up. It's not too late to get vengeance on her killer. Oh my. Aqualad is mine. Oh my. I want a reckoning with Manta. Oh shit. C creating inner turmoil into the light. That's crazy. Plan worked out a little bit better than we thought. I'm um, not gonna lie, Cheshire. That is not your buddy. <laughs> I don't know who you think you are, but you are not touching Aqualad. Roy, wait! Sorry, GA. Can't let you stop me. What? Nigga left a grenade? Yo, why you moving like that? What do you mean stop you? Stop you from doing what, buddy? You have one arm. You trying to take revenge on Lex Luthor already or something? He's going after Lex Luthor. Yep. <laughs> Luthor will kill him. Yeah. You've been out of the game for eight years and you're missing an arm. You are gonna be washed, buddy. Whoa! <laughs> You really don't think his damn glass is missile proof though? I feel like Lex Luthor's like Iron Man level, got Iron Man level defenses. So, how old are you today? Six. <laughs> Six. <laughs> Who the hell is Ivy? It's gonna be your rebound girl. I find it funny how like we always just kind of assume that because they work together that they all have to be friends but I feel like the the uh, the live action Avengers kind of showed us a little bit of that in terms of like just because we work together 
we don't really fuck with each other for real. <laughs> like, of course, on screen, they're gonna be cordial and act happy when they see each other, but they were all terrible friends to one another, especially to Bruce Banner. So far in this verse, it seems like they're all friends and they work together. Wow. Fucking grenade launcher. You see, Red Arrow, if you truly were on BT and you meant exactly what you were saying, why even let the nigga get last words? <laughs> Realistically, he should have just blew his ass up the second he stood up. Damn, what was that camera angle? That looked clean. Hey! <laughs> Yo, he's moving, he's moving. Damn. Yo, for somebody who's been out of the game as long as he said, as long as he has, he's holding his own for real. Hey, oh my gosh. Yo, he's so tack. Damn. He's moving so tack right now. You'll love to see it. Yo, he got it. 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 He got it, bro. Yeah, he ain't the original for nothing. Perfect revenge. Except we gave you anesthesia. Your methods seem a tad more violent. <laughs> Just press the button, nigga. Oh my gosh, you took too long. He didn't even want to kill him. He just wanted to take his arm and make him live with that. <laughs> That's crazy. So I came prepared. Bucky arm? Holy. That was a good ass fight scene, bro. Bet you it's a metal arm, prosthetic arm, something. It's not elegant. Won't fool anyone into thinking it's actual flesh and blood. But it's more powerful and versatile than the model Luther gave his own bodyguard. Knew it. No one's putting me on ice again. Ever. Yo, I fuck with this nigga, bro. I like the OG Speedy, bro. He He's on a different type of timing. What's your new name? Winter Soldier. <laughs> Arsenal. Arsenal, Arsenal, I ain't gonna lie, Arsenal, you got it, nigga, <laughs> you got it, <laughs> that nigga is badass, bro, he's tough, he's tough, that boy was moving like future Gohan fighting the damn androids, <laughs> one arm still winning, low key, oh man, well, but he actually won, I prefer scenes like that way more for some reason, I'm not gonna lie, like when it comes to, obviously, the show is based around the entire team, so there's going to be a lot of team combat, a lot of cooperation going on, combo moves, tag teams, and such. But whenever they got people going on their solo missions and they're actually popping off by themselves, I, I low-key prefer that a little bit more because it gives them, you know, the spotlight for an episode. It allows them to g gain some uh, some respect and have some more achievements under their belt because I mean the only thing that the original Speedy had under his belt right for me was the nigga getting captured <laughs> so the fact that they brought him back and had him pull something off like that that's a plus a plus and then same with the last season and in, in the last season they was making Wally seem mad slow and just kind of mid but then he had his episode where he had a solo mission and was popping off by himself. I like it. I like it a lot, man. I need a I need a solo Nightwing mission. <laughs> a solo Nightwing episode, bro. <laughs> they need to stop doing my boy dirty. But that'll be it for this video. Y'all can let me know what y'all thought in the comments below. If you enjoyed, feel free to leave a like. I shall see y'all in the next one, man.